This is your 10 minute upper body and back workout. All you need is a set of light weights. I'm using one kg, but I guarantee you're gonna still feel the burn, especially if you're a beginner, even without the weights. No matter your level, I'm gonna make sure to challenge you. So get ready and let's match this workout. We have 10 seconds until we start. We're gonna start off on our knees. Grab your weight. We have a front raise, up, down, then to the side into a lateral raise. Let's go. Really control your movement. Go fast on the way up and slowly on the way down. The way that I feel when I'm with you, Shadi, I've been closing my eyes. At halfway, we're gonna make it a little bit more difficult. So now go to the front, then move the arms to the side and drop them down. Then to the side, move them forwards and drop them down. Never ending cycle. Try to want you by my side, girl. I'ma bring you back to my world. No matter the price, it's alright. Anything to win this night, man. For you, I would give my whole life. Okay, amazing work. You have a 15 second break. Meanwhile, if you want to, you can hold those arms to the side. Next up, we have around the world. So again, with those weights or without them, it's your choice. You're gonna lift your arms up in a circle and then slowly, really controlled, drop them down. Fast on the way up and slowly on the way down. Don't feel the same, no. I don't want your arms fully straight. You need to have a tiny bend in your elbows. Engage your core, no overarching, no hunching. This bottle in a pre-roll do be things I never said Living with me like a roomie and took one rose for the beast and the beauty But it ain't really work like the movies Every night ain't the same Give me one more and if you want to you can hold to the side But this time with your palms up Next up we have a steering wheel So we're gonna stick with those shoulders Grab one or two weights or none you're gonna lift the arms to a front raise, twist, twist, and drop them down. I'm going to grab my weight. So to the front, twist, twist, and drop them down. Touch to make this broken heart restart. Can you hear me calling? Can you hear my please? My voice ain't fading. Baby, you all I need. Yeah, yeah. We are halfway, so now I want you to hold to the front and steer here to the end. Come on, you're almost there. Hold it and drop the arms down. Okay, give those shoulders a shake. You did amazing. And now we're coming into our triceps and back. I want you to come into a plank. We have a push-up with a diver. So tuck those toes under. You're gonna give me a tricep push-up so the elbows are next to the body. Extend the arms, squeeze the back, forwards, down, and up into a plank again. If it's too hard for you when you're lifting your feet up, you can keep them down. I'm gonna show you for my next trip. Down, extend the arms with those feet down and up. If you need to, you can go down onto your knees for those push-ups. Okay, we're gonna stick with the push-ups now. So if you need to, you can even come back into a chest pose or push back, whatever you want to call it. Because next up we have a push up, but we're gonna hold down low for three seconds without touching the floor. So tuck those toes under again. Come down as low as you can without touching the floor for three, two, one, and all the way up. Three, two, one, and lift. If you need to, drop those knees down. Hold it here for three, two, one, and lift. 
keep the body in a straight line. Fifteen more seconds. Come on, give me one more rep. And lift it up. Push back if you need to. Next up, you're gonna lie down and we have a set of swimmers. Extend those arms forward. Lift the legs up and you're gonna swim. Okay, let's go. So you're gonna lift the opposite arm with the opposite leg. If you need to, you can drop it down. Lift only one leg up or lift only one arm up with the feet down. You have 15 more seconds. Three, two, one. You can drop it down. Amazing work, staying here with our back. You're gonna keep your feet on the floor this time. For everyone, place the hands behind your head and you're only gonna lift your upper body. Okay, we're starting. So hands are behind the head, lift and lower. Halfway there, now I want you to add a rotation and drop. Lift, rotate and drop. And hold for your last five seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, now I want you to have one weight near you. We're gonna stay in a plank and row. So you're gonna alternate the arms. That's why you need only one weight. Tuck the toes under. Grab the weight with one arm. Row for two reps. Then drop the weight down and change sides. Really squeeze your back when you're rowing. Almost there. And hold it here in a normal plank. You are done. Okay. Dropping the knees down, we are back into a plank. This time you're gonna extend the arm with the weight backwards. Pass for three reps, drop it down, and then change the arm with the weight. Extend your legs, lift them up. One, two, three, and drop the weight down. Tuck your tailbone under. I don't want you to be here. This can hurt your back. So squeeze the booty in, pull the core, and stay here. Okay, try to finish it off with the other arm. Great work. We have only one more exercise left. Remove those weights. We have a reverse plank. This is not an easy one. I think this is one of the exercises I hate the most. Extending those legs, leave the booty up. Head is going to stay behind you. And if you can, try to drive one knee in and then extend the leg, alternating the sides. Mm -hmm. 
if this is too tough for you, bend the knees and you're gonna be here. It's not a problem. I don't know if I'ma make it out alive. My friends got my lady right on my side. Or it's open, yeah, you know the vibe. Sleeping, bumping, got me feeling. Extend those legs. Hold it for five, four, three, two, one. Drop it down and great work. You did great guys. If you enjoyed this workout, please let me know by smashing the thumbs up button. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and click the notification bell so you know whenever I post a new workout. Also guys, please tag me on my social medias because I want to see how you're working out with me, how you're progressing and I'm going to reshare everything on my socials too so you can inspire amazing people to be just as you. So again, thanks for completing this workout with me. Do another one if you want to. Otherwise, I'll see you for our next time. Bye.